I'm Jennifer from Jennifer Decorates and today I have an exciting tutorial on how my husband and I collaborated to make this really cool ottoman that is made from a milk crate carton. So stay tuned. Hi and welcome to my living room. I would describe my living room style as industrial slash vintage. The chair behind me, I actually got two of them at a garage sale for $40 and I had them recovered in this gorgeous gray houndstooth fabric. After sitting in them, we realized we needed an ottoman. So we were shopping in an antique store and came across this really cool wood milk crate. I love it. It says Guernsey Farms on the front. It's made with galvanized steel and on the inside are the bars that held the glass milk bottles. And on the top, it kind of looks like little feet, but that was to uh, make the milk crates interlocking. So my husband actually came up with this idea was to go ahead and make a, re it'd make a really cool ottoman and go with the style of our living room. So let me show you how we did this quick and easy, easy project. You want to get a really good measurement of that little metal post that's on the top. Get a good measurement of your width and your height. Purchase a piece of plywood that's going to be taller than the height of the little metal post, at least a fourth inch taller. The reason for the plywood being taller is because you're going to cut out the little notch for the little metal post, but you're not going to cut all the way through that plywood because we're going to cover fabric over top of it, so it's just going to fit in there really snugly on top of the milk crate. I purchased two inch foam, took a marker, traced the pattern of the plywood, and cut out my foam using scissors. Next you're ready to staple your fabric over your foam and onto the plyboard. You do have to be kind of careful on the corners and staple close to the edges because you don't want to cover up your corner cutout. So if you'd like to do this project, you could find this a very similar milk crate carton at an antique or vintage store, and I've also seen them on sale at eBay. Thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and have a wonderful day. Thank you. Thank you.